Leaks show us that the plans for wireless audio on the iPhone 7 Pro have been years in the making. Some of the new Samsung pens show us an Apple Watch design, and it actually has a purpose, and Google has finally decided to take now on tap more seriously. I'm Jaime Rivera, and I am seriously willing to take my computer to edit this at the bar in the corner. Happy Friday, everyone. This is Pocket Now Daily. The official news today begin with deals. If you want to still get an LG G5, which is still one of my favorite phones if it wasn't for that feel at the bottom of the chassis, I would highly suggest you follow the link in the description. There is this limited time offer on eBay, $400 unlocked. It doesn't get any better than that. Other official news have to do with Google. I rarely use now on tap and it has everything to do with the fact that I feel that Google now got crippled. But uh, the feature is useful and for those of you that don't really find Google Now cards or now on tap cards for whatever you're looking for, the cool thing is that now you're not gonna get a blank display. If Google's not able to find anything, a new update will allow Google Now cards to show up on now on tap. What took you so long? Let's move the spotlight over to Samsung. This is interesting. The company has just filed a new patent for a modular smartwatch, which is awesome. Imagine being able to attach things to your smartwatch. The funny thing is that uh, it's taken the internet by storm because Samsung, for some reason, is using Apple Watch diagrams on that patent filing. That is going to be rather interesting if it goes any further whenever Apple discovers this. Now, speaking of Apple, this is even more interesting. There are some trusted analytics that confirm that the company is not really doing well at all at India. Uh, surely the company sells millions and millions of phones every quarter, but apparently the company barely reached 800,000 units in India, reaching a very small fraction of the percentage of the market where Android reigns supreme at 97% and then Windows 10 Mobile or Windows Mobile for that matter owns most of the rest of the chunk. Uh, whether Apple plans to do something about it is yet to be seen, but we do know that the company considers India to be a big market. They just need to lower those price tags. And finally, the very hot news they have to do with the iPhone 7 Pro and the fact that the company has been working for years in bringing high quality audio through Bluetooth ear pods. And obviously it's taken time, probably the technology is not there. We do know that Bluetooth audio isn't better in any way compared to wired audio. Uh, but then again, we hear that Apple is doing that. The company is also working on bringing wired headphones to the lightning connector. We thought we'd get an adapter, but at least show us that there is a pair of ear pods with the connector directly, which is rather interesting. And uh, hey, it leads me to the question of the day. How picky are you when it comes to audio? Do you only listen with wires and audio DAC, etc., or do you just enjoy the convenience of Bluetooth? In my case, it depends. If I'm on the subway, which is extremely noisy, I prefer wired headphones because they sound better, but uh, if not, then I'll be fine with Bluetooth. I just want to hear what I'm playing. Leave us a comment down below. We'd love to know your opinion. Friends, you know the way it goes. If you want to get the news earlier before the video is filmed, follow us on pocketnow.com and hit that subscribe button down below for more videos like this one. You can also catch our videos on Vessel, vessel.com slash pocketnow, and follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera, or on Instagram at Jaime Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thank you very much for watching. We'll see you next week.